Welcome back to Gunlocker 75. Today we're going to be looking at a rifle sling from Easy Shoot. Easy Shoot was nice enough to send this out for a review. We are taking it out of the package for the very first time. Comes in a basic package, got a label on it. Just basic packaging, but uh, first impressions are the shoulder uh, pad feels nice and soft. It does feel pretty durable, the buckles. So we will uh, slap it on a rifle and take a closer look at it. The stitching looks really good. Seems really durable. I don't see any issues with any of that. This sling, this is a two-point rifle sling. Currently on Amazon for $13.95. So it is a budget sling. This is the camo black color. Neoprene padded. Adjustable length. Goes from 23 to 52 inches. So it's got really good adjustability. Heavy duty Rifle sling swivel. Fits slings up to 1.25 inches wide. The tri-lock design, which provides secure locking. So you can lock it in place. The swivels are tested up to 300 pounds. The sling is made out of a nylon Material, non-slip, and wear resistant. So we have a Ruger M77 here that we'll install it on. Basically, any rifle that has these type of swivel studs, this sling will immediately uh, install on. So I have a couple of Ruger M77s that it would work on. I have a M1 carbine that it would work on. Um, I have a old Husqvarna 30 odd six it would work on. I know like your Savage rifles, any of your hunting rifles, most of them have that type of swivel system. This sling will immediately install on those. We're going to take and push and twist to open that up. Then we'll feed that, push, and twist, and it's on. And then we're gonna go ahead and screw that down to lock it in. Now this never stops, just so you know, it never stops. Like you don't, it's not like a nut where you get and it's tight, but it doesn't allow it now to push and come undone. So even though it keeps spinning, once you're all the way in, you're locked, like you can't push this. So just so, just so you know, that's uh, normal. Now we will install the rear. Same deal. We're going to push it out, twist it to open it up, feed it through our hole, push, and then we're going to spin this so it's locked in. Our rifle sling is now installed. We did some adjustments. 
trying to get it the right size that we want here. I think maybe the back one needs a little bit of adjusting. And let's see, let's see how she fits now. That's pretty good for just a over the shoulder. If I wanted to go cross, I probably would loosen it up a little bit, which is pretty easy to do. And then I, you can adjust these sliders so you don't have as much travel. I guess too, if you really wanted to, and you didn't want all this excess, and you were never going to go beyond that, you know, if you get an idea of where where you want this set, you could trim that off. So if we were going to do a cross body now, that's a pretty good fit. It's pretty comfortable. I would say, I mean, it's on the smaller side. I've had some slings with a bigger pad. You know, if you're going to go on a one week hunt and you're going to be hiking every day for six hours with this thing slung on you, I don't know that this is the sling for that, like really extreme conditions. But for just your everyday basic stuff that most of us do, you know, walking around your yard if you have property or the range or just kind of your basic, what I would consider normal behaviors, I think this sling is fine for that. Um, if you're going to go on an extreme hunting trip, then I think that's where you would invest some more money, you know, into a thicker, heavier duty. It's very simple, but for what it is, $13.95, you know, you're going to throw it on your Ruger 1022 or, or uh, you know, just basic everyday use. I think it's fine. I think that's really what it's meant for, you know. Um, it's just another option at a small cost. So I'm definitely... Uh, you know, I'm looking at it for what it is. I, I think that it's a good product. It's made well. I, you know, if you were going to try to recreate this for $13.95, like, I don't know how you would do it, you know. So, uh, that's how I'm looking at it. I, I think it's well built for what it is, you know. So, anyways, those are my thoughts on it. I, I do think it's worth purchasing if you're purchasing it for the right reason, just kind of basic use. Um, especially, uh, you know, if you're going to just do some light hunting, uh, I think it's fine. So that is the review on this Easy Shoot two point rifle sling in the camel black 1395 on amazon i will leave the link in the description also we'll leave the link for their page easy shoot thank you again for sending it out and we will see you on the next one